So I had a recent question regarding my wedding planner template. Can you tell me how to add extra tasks into the task table? So let's jump over to the fifth sheet, which is tasks. And you're going to notice in, when you press the end key on the keyboard, it goes to I38. If I press home, it goes back to the top. So the first row where you can enter in a task. Uh, so let's press the end key again. We're on the last row. And I didn't think anyone would need more tasks than this, but uh, what we can do is this. First of all, we're going to unprotect the workbook. Go to Review on the ribbon. Click Unprotect Sheet. Type in Test, T-E-S-T. -E press the OK button. And second thing we're going to do is press on View. Click head Headings. Now we can see uh, we're on row 38. Now we want to uh, sort of left click and drag down so left click the entire row 38 and sort of drag it down and then right click unhide so now we see all the rows going down to uh, over 1 million and we've got two options here we can go to the last cell and press the tab key to add an another task or now that the sheet is unlocked, I can go to Table Tools, because this is a table setup. I can go to Table Tools. I can say Resize Table. And all I have to do is change 40 to, let's say, 500. Let's say it's a really busy wedding. Change that to 500. Press OK. And you're going to see this change down here. So we don't have to do Tab every time. Now you've got lots of space, many more rows to add tasks. Um, now, I think it's the same over here in Contact input sheet. We can go review, unprotect, T-E-S-T -E for test. Press the OK button. Press the end key. Oh, I just, put, here we go. The end, so now we're down on, let me just do view, headings, 318. That's the row again. I can go to table tools, resize table, change that from ending at row 318 to row 500. Press the OK button and now it goes much further down. Uh, so that is basically it, how to unprotect and then how to extend a table.